everyone. Sorry for the wait. Uh, Rio and I were having a little discussion. Anyway, welcome to the. Yep, welcome to the stream, and we're back with more Trails of Cold Steel with my friend Rio. And I know someone else is there besides me, so I don't know who it is though. Let me. No, I mean in the chat, in the, I mean watching the stream. I mean someone else watching the stream besides me. Or who is being acknowledged as watching the stream. Okay, it is Ike. So, sorry we kept you waiting, Ike. Hey, Ike, how you doing? Okay. Hopefully he's even there. <laughs> anyway, let's load up the game. Uh, or I will. You, I think you already have. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I am right outside room 201. Okay, that's our room. Yeah, so is that what we're supposed to do now, is return to our room? Or do we need to do something else? Yeah, but I'm saying, what are we doing next is what I'm asking. <laughs> ah, well, we can talk to all our buddies, have a little chat time with, uh, with all of our fellow classmates, as well as with my instructor Sarah and uh, the cook. Okay, and well, I need to leave the dorm, the this building first. No. Oh, I, oh, you mean we talk to them in here? Okay, gotcha. Well, I've already found Sarah. She's on the sitting on this bench here. <laughs> so let me know when you're at her, okay? I'm at her. Okay. I'm back. Sh should I be doing her drunk voice? Oh, I thought you were. Uh, I thought you were talking to Laura, but. No, I said it's Sarah. <laughs> no, I'm screwed up. Okay. Well, are you already talking to Laura? Because I'm already talking to Sarah. Yeah, I'm, talking, I'm talking to Laura. Well, go ahead and read hers then. Yeah, I'm not. I'm waiting for you. <laughs> okay. And like I said, I'm thinking maybe I'm supposed to be doing her drunk voice right now. <laughs> I'm back! Whew, it's been a while since I got this plastered. Tell me you instructed Of course not. He hardly even drank anything. Now, Instructor Thomas, though, wow, you should have seen him drain those beers. I did my best to rise to the challenge, of course, but he just kept chugging away. It's like the booze didn't even phase him. I think I've heard of it before long ago. I think it is what you said, Reen. <laughs> Let me talk to her one more time just to see if she says anything different. Maid, where's that water I asked for? Don't you think, don't you think I'll forget this, Thomas. I'll drink you and your fogged up glasses under the table one day. Why am I not surprised at <laughs> uh, Probably because you already know her that well. Okay, who next? And where's she at? Which room? Double doors to, to your right. The one without windows? Uh, let me see here. There are two kinds of people. Okay. 
Uh, Ike says there are two kinds of people. Those who are playing a JRPG and those who are playing Final Fantasy VII Remake. <laughs> yeah. I guess he's not wrong. Now again, do you mean the ones with or without Windows? Without. Okay. And yeah, here she is. But yeah, you're not wrong there, Ike. Just about everyone's playing that game right now. Lady Sarah returned home a few moments ago. Master Nightheart uh, was even such a gentleman as to escort her back, too. It would seem that Lady Sarah had an enjoyable evening drinking with her co worker. <laughs> I wouldn't be opposed to the idea of joining them sometime. Should the opportunity present itself, is she legal age to drink? I think so. Oh. She's the only place on the list of foster drinkers. Yeah, me too! <laughs> well, she I should prepare some water for Lady Star. <laughs> Alternatively, some more alcohol may be pleasing to her. Please don't. <laughs> <laughs> I think Rain thought the same way as me, yeah. Okay. And now we're to next. Uh, Hello, Ike. How are you tonight? Uh, well, who? Uh, what are their other options tonight? Everyone of our class. Okay. Uh, let's see who's in this door. The one closest to the exit of the the wall. The one right next to the mailboxes, but not the exit, the single door. Nothing. Uh, yep, yeah, no one in here, you're right. Okay, let's try the one further down from there, next to the stairway. Nope, no one here either. Okay, let's go up the stairs then. Alright, you go to the left or the right? Uh, let's go left, and I'm going in 206. Left. Left. Oh. Oh. Then no, then 201 is us, isn't it? Yeah, well, I said 206. This appears to be a vacant room. Okay, well, I'll go the other way then. Um, good. Finish second chapter of Trails 3 and basically that. Uh, basically what now? Let's see, 202, and here's Elliot. Aw, is he homesick a little bit? Well, let's see what he has to say again. Oh, good idea. Oh, well, that's not the time to be thinking about the summer festival anyway. We've got our practical exam, and another field study comes up. And then I've got the boy to work until collection next month. I've got no shortage of things to focus on. And I feel like I have to do well on the home. The home. Yep, he is going to be occupied. Okay, let's go to... Let's go to 205. Is there any... Okay, this is Makai's room. Depend on the person, though, Macias. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And now to two o 
no wait, 202 was where we were. 203. And that's useless. Talking to him again. Anything else? How should I spend the day tomorrow? Always wind up with far too much free time when the writing club doesn't need it. Well, that, yeah, that's kind of. Okay, talk to him again. I'm sure it will. Okay. It's, let's see, that was all the guys. Where are they at? Oh, up on the third floor. Okay. I missed this other stairway is all. <laughs> okay, there's Laura. Let me talk to Laura real quick to catch up. <sighs> Huh, it's rare to hear you sound like that. I'm feeling tired, that's all. Lately, between swimming lessons and club practice, I feel like I've been more... I spend more time in the water than out. I guess I still have ways to go. <laughs> her clash with Fee must still be bothering her. And let me talk to her again. Phew, calling a day a little earlier than usual. Feels like a smart choice right now. I still have quite a ways to go. Okay, uh, let's see, let's start with 301. Um, uh, never mind, I think this is Laura's room. Either, I think that was Laura's room, so never mind. At least it's empty. 306, which is vacant. <laughs> uh, so, 302. And this is Alyssa's room. Tell me when you're ready. It definitely feels like summer is here now that our swimming lessons have started. I was thinking about going to the boutique tomorrow to buy some new clothes, but I don't know if I should. Hmm, our summer uniforms are fairly comfortable too. I guess I shouldn't buy trendy c huh? I guess I shouldn't buy trendy clothes if I won't have a chance to wear them. It's logical, but still disappointing. Okay, talking to her again. I wonder how my grandfather's doing, actually. I can see the highlands being cool in the summer, but they're supposed to get really cold as soon as it hits fall. I'm a little worried about him now. Maybe I should talk to Sharon about this. You know, it's funny, Alyssa. I've got this note asking how <laughs> we're getting along with our dates. Hey, what?! Okay, 3.05. And... Oh, Fee! What the heck are you doing up there? At first I thought this room was empty. Ready. Oh, oh, Rain. Yeah, and you're sitting on a box. I'm fine. Did you need something? Okay, I thought maybe this was just typical of her, but Reed's questioning it too. 
weapons, explosives, all that good stuff. <laughs> yeah. I know how to handle them. That's probably a bad thing, though. Huh? Nothing. I'm going to sleep. Night. Night. Okay, talking to her again. I'm gonna sleep. Night. Wanna sleep together? <laughs> what the hell, Rufi? Yeah, it's a good idea. Let's get out of here, Ring. <laughs> okay, next is 304. And this is Emma's room. <laughs> good evening, Ring. Uh, what Ike? Yeah, he said yes, damn it. Oh, talking about sleeping with Fee, I guess. <laughs> That's right. They're called tarot cards. My grandmother taught me how to use them. Something simple. Hmm. Ah, oh, let's go with this then. Emma thoroughly shuffled her cards and picked one. The Wheel of Fortune in the upright position. This card represents chance, change, and turning points in life. So a general reading would suggest that you're approaching a major turning point in your life. Huh. That's a bit big, isn't it? <laughs> Sorry. I'm still learning the finer points of reading the cards. I am rather curious about this result, though. Yeah, me too. Oh, yeah, let me talk to her again. Yeah, sorry. I suppose I just need more practice with the cards. There are multiple ways each result can be interpreted. Seeing the truth of a reading can be difficult to master. <laughs> Guess I'll ask you for another reading sometime. Feel free to. Alright, and now... For 303. Which... I think this is Fee's room, so who was in the other room that was empty? No, this is Laura's room right here. Oh, this is Laura. What? Oh, you're right. Well, who was. Well, what? There was, another, there was another empty room, though. Hang on a minute. Sure. Let's see. There's a list. Oh, I guess. Would she be in the student dorms, though? Let's see. Yeah, this is Fee. Oh, yeah, it's definitely hers. Look at, look at, the, look at what's in the, in, the, in the crate next to the bed. Oh, yep. Yeah. You're right, this is her room. <laughs> Dang, look at all this paperwork on her desk. Look how much beer is still on, on her desk. None. I said it's all paperwork. Yeah. And books. And what's close to her bed? Beer. Yeah, but that's not on her desk. <laughs> there's some on the there's a bunch on the shelf though. That, that's it. And some by the door. <laughs> There's a bunch by the door on this shelf. Jeez, girl, what the hell? I'm I'm like Rain. Haven't you heard of moderation? Is she using this box as a table? I think I heard of that sometime a long time ago in a land far, far away. Uh, and what are these canned things she has here? Is this what she eats? Yeah, probably wouldn't surprise me. Ugh, okay. I don't know who need who needs to be looking out for who. Uh, let's see. We've spoken to everyone then. <laughs> yep. So I guess we go on to bed now. Yep. All right. We'll do. Let's see. Two o one, which is over here. <laughs> okay. I'm I'm talking to the door now. <laughs> Rain's talking. Yeah. Should I call it a day? Choosing to rest will cause the day to change and the main story to advance. Yes. I love... I think that is one thing I miss. I miss the RPGs that have the cute music when they go to sleep. <laughs> Or the peaceful music, I guess I should say. 
Okay. Oh, did Reen get some more mail? Oh, up to right. Obtain student council task July. Okay. Um, let's read all of them. We'll start with the required one. This mo- Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, now for childhood friends' intentions. Okay, this is a girl, so I'll read this one. I've known this boy since we were kids, but I have no idea what's on his mind lately. To be honest, I'm a bit worried. Would someone be able to give me some advice on how to handle this? I'll be in the upper class dormitory if you can help. Bridget, year one, class 11? Yeah, 11. Two. Row two, okay, yeah. Yeah, Roman numerals, you're right. Okay, and then snap. Um, I'm going to assume this is a guy. Okay, and where was the sec uh, the upper class dormitory, okay. The yeah. Anyway, I've exited out of the mail wow. now. Okay, yeah, we have three free thingies. Bonding points. Yeah, bonding points. Okay, let's see. Who do I want to hang out with? Well, let's see who's where, first of all. Uh, let's see. Alyssa is in the boutique. Uh, Micaias is in the cafe and inn. Sarah... I don't know where the heck that is. It's close to us, though. Gaius is somewhere on the second floor of the dormitory. <laughs> Um, and let's see, where's everyone else? Um, Laura's in the gymnasium. Where's Fee? Oh, there's Fee. She's on the first floor of the main building. And Elliot's on the second floor. <laughs> let's see. Who do I want to hang out with first? Yeah, I know. It's a tough choice, isn't it? What's that? Swimming. Oh boy. In this, right now, like in this part? pointed out even I'm not super eager to do it again and I wasn't expecting it this soon <laughs> I cut cuz cuz truthfully I kind of knew we would might have to do it again but I, I didn't think it would be this soon I told you neither am I anyway I'm trying to figure out who I want to hang out with first um I can't remember their names but it's the student council president and the guy with the white hair with the bandana, they're in the engineering building, I think. Either that or the student union, I can't, yeah, I think it's student union. Uh, we got Alyssa, Emma, B, Jesus, Gaius, Gaius, and Sarah. Doesn't look like we can hang out with Laura, at least not for a free time. Uh, nope. So, 
There's Emma, Yusuf, um, Fee, Gaius, Sarah, and Macias, and Alyssa. Right. And Sarah. That's it, yeah, said Sarah. Okay, you know what? I'm actually kind of curious on what Sarah wants. Okay. So let's go visit her. I think she's right here anyway. Yeah, there she is. Okay, let's boogie. Oh, maybe she's not actually... What, what? Okay, anyway, it's Reen's turn when you get there. Yeah, let's go. Looks like I got no shortage of dance partners today. Alright, the way seems so let's get started. Hope you all can keep up. Huh? <clears throat> Rain, what are you doing out here? Aw, I'm touched. Oh, we actually are fighting? I think I've got this though. Why don't you just sit back and watch? And begin! Okay, never mind. <laughs> there we go, easy peasy. How'd you like that? Willing to admit how awesome and cool your instructor is now? Well, I can't deny your skill. <laughs> Let's start. So you came out here to train them? Pretty much. I wonder how. I wonder if you. Uh, I wander out here every now and then to lay into the wildlife. A gal's got to stay in safe sh shape somehow, you know. <laughs> Guess I look pretty dumb rushing in to try to help you out, huh? That's not entirely true. I appreciate the sentiment, at least. Seeing you dashing in, all worried about little old me, it made me smile. Alas, dear Reen, I don't want to break your sweet young heart, but we're teacher and student. It'd never work out. Gotcha. How will I ever cope? <laughs> anyway, now that you're here, you might as well get in on the fun. Think of it as a special private lesson just for you. Yeah, the boy. And so, Rain joined us. Your bond with Instructor Sarah strengthened. Okay. Um. Let's see. Two more. Yep. Let's see. Two more. Um. Let's see. Oh, well, I was looking at the map to decide who to spend time with next, but sure. Well, color me surprised. I never expected you to be so concerned that you just had to chase after me like that. That did end up making for a pretty good training session, though. I'll keep you in mind for next time, then. Okay. okay. Let's see. Macias, Alyssa, Gaius, uh, Yusis, Emma. I think that's it, right? Okay, let's see. Who do I want to hang out with? I really only have two left, is the problem. Um. 
You want to pick this time since I picked Sarah? Oh, no. Yeah, no problem. Uh, according to the walkthrough guide here, I mean, it's up to, uh, I'll just put it to you this way. We're going to be hanging out with, uh, with Fee and, Fee and Elliot and Laura. Yeah, Fee's the only one. Fee's the only one out of those we can hang out with, though, I think. Right, but, uh, if we hang out with Alyssa, we get another page to her character profile. And okay. if we hang out with Emma, we get a page added to someone named Dorothy. Hmm, interesting. Um. Give us like XP plus 500. So. Yeah, okay. Um, let's start with, oh, let's start with Alyssa. Okay. And she Yep. Okay, there she is. With Sharon, of course. <laughs> oh, you didn't teleport there? No. Oh. Tell me when you're ready. Go. Hmm, what kind of clothes would he like? <clears throat> Yeah, Sharon's helped me pick out some clothes for him to wear in the fall. After I was lucky enough to meet with him on last month's field study, it only feels right to send him a little gift. <laughs> they should arrive just in time if we send them in the next few days. Now all we need to do is find something that actually suits him. Been time with Alyssa. Time with Alyssa. Body point. Yes. Would you like me to help you pick something? I mean, I'm a guy and I wear clothes, so. Uh, yeah, I'd be worried if you didn't, Green. <laughs> really? Nice of you to offer. A more masculine perspective would be much appreciated. I trust that you would pick up something fitting, Masterine. Oh, this jacket looks nice. He does like to dress pretty well, so maybe something like this would be good. A splendid idea. I'm sure he prefers that to a gift that reflects his age. However, he might not have many opportunities to wear this over in Lord. Hmm, you're probably right. How about getting something for his outdoor activities? He really seems to like driving around and fishing. Uh. Now that's a good idea. You know all that stuff pretty well, don't you? <laughs> I guess this is your chance to shine. <laughs> Here's hoping I don't, I don't disappoint. Let's start by taking a look over there. How about these boots? Hmm, that's true. Hey, one of us has some that might work. I think he could put the hat and be pretty special. Spend so much time outdoors outside. You're right, let's go have a look. <laughs> yep, you're enjoying this, aren't you, Sharon? Oh, those are nice. How about this one? Great, then we have our gift. Sharon, could you... Huh? Where'd she go? Something tells me she disappeared while our attention was on, was on those hats. Maybe she was trying to give us a long time. Mm -hmm. Dang it, dang it, Sharon. <laughs> well, either way, I'm 
way to take the, take the steps to the register. Oh, that would explain why she was hanging out with your grandfather so much. Mm-hmm. Shay's probably gone back to the dorm, so we can show her later. <laughs> yeah, thanks, Reen. Your bond with Alyssa bond strengthened. With and Link level 4. Oh, I think it's maxed out. Yeah. Rena and Alyssa reached Link level 4. Powerful strike and cheer. <laughs> what does cheer do? <laughs> no idea. Yeah. Okay. We have one more. Um. Let's see. So, the way you talked... Fee or Emma would be the best choice. <laughs> it depends on who we're gonna link with. Uh, and uh, in our next session. Uh. He's the only one that we can hang out with today. But. Uh, no, we can hang out with Emma. Well, we can, we can hang out with Emma too. What do you mean? Oh, well, that's true. Okay, yeah, let's go with Fee, then. And she's on the main, first floor of the main building. Hm? Now, Emma will give us a new character's profile, so. Well, okay, which do you think is better, then? I picked the last two, so... Yeah. Let's do Emma, and it'll give us uh, about 100 experience with her, anyway. Okay, sounds good. Okay, and where is she at? In this, I mean, I know she's in where where she's at, but uh, where at? Where is she at? Second floor. Oh, second floor. Okay. Uh, which room? <laughs> Wait a minute, I'm lost. Okay, I think I went. No, I'm in the student union. So, where room is she in? Yeah, second floor, I know that. Oh, well, I'll just start looking. Oh yeah, she's in the first one, the literature club. Huh? Uh, let me talk to this other girl first. I'm just curious what she says. <laughs> I hope Emma enjoys my book. Oh, okay. But even more than that, I hope that she and I will be able to join forces and create them together one day. Okay, let's talk to Emma now. Oh, and Ike said cheer gives some health and CP, but it is random. <laughs> Thanks for Ike. Yeah. Irene, um, how do I explain this? The Dorothy asked me to proofread this manuscript of hers, you see? Sounds like a rough job. I'm feeling perfectly fine. And th this manuscript definitely isn't full of salacious imagery either. Oh dear. <laughs> See, what now? Anyway, I'm feeling fine, so there's no need to worry. Be good. I'm glad I picked this. We win with this now. Oh, please say you loved it. It'd make my world feel so much wider. 
Dorothy wrote these sorts of stories until recently. <laughs> it is the genre of young womanhood. Come on, you two. There's a lot more for you to proofread. Sweat drop? Yep. That genre seems to be getting more and more popular with an Erebonia lately. Well, to each his or her own, I guess. Well, I'm glad to have always, well, I'm always glad to have my horizons brought. They definitely could have dealt with us some of the more graphic details. Uh huh. <laughs> Agreed. I feel a little flustered myself after that. <sighs> I got so embarrassed that I thought of my glasses. Emma removed her glasses and placed them on the table. Emma? Yes? Is something wrong? Oh no! It's just the first- this is the first time I've seen you without your glasses on. Well, what? Phew. Uh, sorry. I didn't mean to stare. It's just, I mean... I'm sure not complaining. <laughs> How embarrassing. Or perhaps we should get back to proofreading now. Oh yeah. Right. Uh, there's no need to force yourself to the worst of these. If they get too graphic, I'll take care of them. And thus they return to the club room to wade through erotic tales of passionate young manhood once again. Oh. <laughs> As Rain and Emma neared the brink of exhaustion, the proofreading finally came to an end. Oh boy, your bond with Emma strengthened. Okay. So what do you want to do now? Let's see, where do I... Character? Uh, what class is... Where do I find her at? Uh, you said we had Dorothy's profile. Where is it under? Uh, not class 1 or 2. Not... Uh, no. Uh, no. Where? Okay, there it is. <laughs> Uh, year two, class five, the imaginative head of the literature club is often a little too excited over the stories she reads. Maidenly hobby, she writes somewhat obscene stories about romance between young men. Um, yeah, can I say something about the way her, a picture of her there? Yeah. I'm not sure if you're, first off, are you familiar with the anime Future Diaries? She looks a lot like the female main character, and that's not necessarily a good thing. <laughs> Anyone who's seen Future Diary probably knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> anyway, I found- I had some other new- Okay, I think Ike knows what I'm talking about. Have you seen Future Diary? <laughs> uh, let's see, Fidelio. Year 2, Class 2. Kind, sensible head of the photography club. While a noble, he doesn't place importance on social class. Okay, that's good. <laughs> uh, let's see, and there was someone, was there someone else I hadn't read yet? I think so. Let's see, Rex. A member of the photography club who has little interest in taking photographs of anything but attractive girls. While he's not the best at taking photographs of scenery, he's an expert at taking pictures of girls. Monk, you're one... Yes, I know, and she looks different when you visited the larger club because she's wearing glasses. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> Year 1, Class 5. A boy who doesn't stand out very much. This is Monk. 
always looking for material for something. He sends radio addict. He sends in lots of material to the radio show, radio show at bedtime, time, as a lot of Stein sign stickers for doing so. Rosine, class, year one, class five, a deeply spiritual, noble-minded girl. Can get along with just about anyone. Alright. I think that's everyone I haven't read yet then. Okay, yeah. Um, so, what do you want to do now? Are you still wanting to play some more? Well, no, I'm asking if you're still up to playing. Okay. Um, the. Where at? The bookstore? Oh, we can also speak to, uh. Western people. Yeah, but I'm asking where we. Where you were talking about. Where yeah, that. We'll go to the bookstore. It's in town. Okay. okay. Uh, so let's see. I'll go to the. F Wait. Krista. Um, I'll start at the park, I guess. Yeah, park's okay. probably the best place. Well, I'm talking about where I had to teleport to. <laughs> yeah, the front entrance. Then you can go to the bookstore. Oh, I thought the bookstore was on this end. No, bookstore. Yes, it is. It's on the end that I went to. I went to the- I told you I went to the park. There is Bentley Munchies Coffee. Okay, um, where is it at? On campus. No, you said it was in the bookstore. Ugh. Yeah, it's on- the bookstore is on campus. Yeah, but I'm asking where the book is. You have to buy it. Oh, okay, sure. well, okay, let's see, shop. Buy 1,000, so I need to get some Mira. Just a moment. Let's see. Okay, I'll just exchange 100 for now to have enough for the book. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I bought it now. <laughs> Well, I haven't, but I don't have that much money. Let me see. How much do they cost? Swimming strategies. Swimming strategies. Okay. Yeah, let's buy that. Military okay. mania yeah. and Erebonian yeah. art history. I don't know if I ha I don't know if I have this one either. It doesn't say I do. I so let's see. One six. One six. Oh, uh, 100, 600, 11, 16. Okay, so I need 1600. <laughs> Alright. Uh, actually, we would be able to buy them. They're not grayed out anyway. But, I get what you, but yeah. Okay, I have all the books now. <laughs> okay, hang on a minute. Let me go into my items. Um, okay, not items. I guess I go into the... This. Let's see. Yeah, books. Here we go. Um, other... No, not other. Huh? Oh, well you... Uh, no, you said books. I'm, uh, just yeah. a minute. Okay, I gotcha. Um, let's see. Okay, just a minute. Just bear with me a moment, okay? Yeah. Within the book is a recipe you've never seen before. Obtain the recipe for roasted coffee. Alright, uh, let's see, where were the other... Okay, swimming strategies. Glance through swimming strategies. 
Uh, it's about how to improve your swimming form. It's kind of confusing without someone to show you the motion, so maybe Laura can help me with that. And we got a few link points, 100 link points for Laura. Uh, let's see. Okay, um. Military mania. And we got 100 points for Feast. Yep. Okay, and there was one more book, wasn't there? Uh, let's see, it was this one, right? And we can't use it, so... <laughs> no, I can't, it's grayed out. Oh, I, th I was talking about the Imperial Chronicle one. Uh, Glance Through Erebonian Art History. Wow, this book is guy. And 100 points with Gaius. Okay, now that's everything. <laughs> So, what do you want to do now? Uh, no. Alright, let's take a look here. Look at what? I said let's take a look here. Yeah, but at what? Uh, walk through. Oh, okay, gotcha. But I was asking what you want to do. <laughs> yeah, let's call it a night here. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we're going to call it a night now. And when will you be on again? Since we're so far behind because of my... Uh, my aunt, off of the back of the night, so we can try and get the shot our free time. Okay, sounds good. And... Hi. And then I'll be back on Monday for more Final Fantasy 15. So, thanks for everyone that tuned in tonight. And I will see you either tomorrow night or Monday, depending on when you're able to tune in. So, and if you'll stick around, I will be hosting a stream. I just need to find who I want to host tonight. Uh, let's see. Uh, no Final Fantasy 7 remake channels, so that is going to narrow it down quite a bit, I think. <laughs> uh, let's see. Um. Um, no, not Professor Daisuke either. Um. Hmm. Um, like I said, this is going to be a tough choice. Um, I think I may host, um, I think I'll host Atma Lumina, who's playing Final Fantasy VIII. Uh, thanks, yeah, good night, yeah, good night, Ike. Um, glad you enjoyed it. So, let's see, um... Well, I'll talk to you tomorrow, I can. Yeah, good night. See you tomorrow, Rio. Bye. And as I said, I am going to head off now as well, so as soon as I host, I hope you will stick around for that. And good night, everyone. Bye.